yeah hello so i will be reading your prompt so let's start with the palm reading so in the palm reading we specify the section from reading the fingers then the mount then go for the lines okay so we'll start from this uh, thumb area so this is the thumb and you can see and here you will see that if it will try to stretch if you try to stretch your thumb it will not go uh, more than 90 degree so it says to be uh, like you are the person who are a little bit believing the people and making your uh, own decision in mixture of that because your angle is uh, not uh, i can say um, uh, very much below the below the 90 degree it will be almost similar to 90 degree so you will try to make your own decision but uh, you will also obey the religion way and your you can say moral support and moral value also you will be having okay and then this uh, there is one good sign in your uh, thumb area which is like eye symbol on the palm so eye symbol on this front uh, thumb below the thumb area is good it's said to be a fortunate uh, sign where it describes that the person will not face uh, issue related to uh, finance or money where whether he he or she will be needing that amount so from somewhere uh, the person will get it so that this is a good thing which indicate the good financial state of the person okay then uh, the next line we have to read which is the uh, ring thing our first uh, finger which is the jupiter ring so jupiter one is the uh, jupiter finger it give rise to leadership quality management skill teaching skills and skills that really require like attention seeking and uh, like, ma making people understand by yourself uh, something like that so you have a good uh, direction of the uh, line so if the finger is very straight it's said to be a quality used in the positive directions and also below this finger there is a mount so this mount is also uh, well developed so you will be having good leadership quality in your life so that you can utilize and make your own decision properly and good dis uh, leadership quality of jupiter is also one of the sign of uh, having a good career and uh, you can also say the person will be good in managing managing people in other ways other than that we have a second finger which is the mid middle finger and this is also called as saturn finger so saturn finger what it gives rise to is like good execution planning if this line uh, of finger is straight it's said to be a good execution and planning kind of finger so you will be having good execution and planning and below the area this is also well developed so you, you will uh, be able to uh, get the result out of your execution and planning so this is a good sign one more thing is like uh, our ring finger so in ring finger what i see is that uh, the when we compare the first finger and the ring finger ring finger is little bit higher than the um, our first finger so it says to be uh, like uh, the person will be uh, more into a social uh, life or you can say a person will be a uh, love to the nature and uh, liking the product clothing and etc because the person will be having good materialistic pleasure in their life so you will be having a uh, orientation on that part so you will be inclined to that area or their interest other than that we have uh, uh, our little finger so little finger it said that if little finger is going beyond this uh, line or you can say a second phalange of the ring finger then person will be having good leaderships uh, good communications interpersonal skills and business and, uh, and technical skills too so it is also said to be a good political skills so in, in your area if it is going to touch on this line so it will be in this line only so it is moderate uh, you can say quality but you can use um, your moderate quality too because it's not a uh, curve curve a finger so you will be using your quality in a positive direction so overall this palm said to be a positive uh, palm but let's go to the mount area so this one i have described so it is the jupiter mount where jupiter mount is also known for this uh, proper quality if uh, you, your finger is straight and clear but the mount is not well developed the quality associated with that will not be very much but in your case it is present so you will get good quality on that part and second finger is second finger mount is also a good and well developed so you will get a uh, your result of execution planning uh, you can say uh, quickly and other than that this area the saturn one is little bit uh, un un underdeveloped so it's said to be uh, you can say that 
to uh, get the materialistic pleasure and success in life and uh, more of the like you can say name fame will be a little bit uh, you can say hard working for you so if you do a uh, hard work so you uh, will get that part because there is a sign that you will get a uh, uh, parents properties or you can say inherited property because there is a line uh, here which said to be a, a line of uh, inherited property and second involves mood swings okay and uh, other than that we have uh, uh, our venus mount so venus mount is said to be a public attraction so you can say family support will be there public attraction will be there if this is good you will be a center of attraction if it is well developed so right now it is uh, normal so you can say the quality will be moderate and other than that we have a mount of moon so this area is called as mount of moon if mount of moon is well developed you will be having a very good imagination skills and you can say uh, interpersonal skills and also the person will be a little bit of a uh, person who uh, uh, follow uh, his emotions more than intellect intellectual so if these are all good your uh, you can say inner inner peace you will be finding if it is not good then uh, you will be finding a little bit confused life so these are the indication for that but uh, what i see is that it is developed but it needs to be more uh, sharpen in future way and uh, because the line uh, on that on this uh, mount is not very much uh, confident about this career uh, that I will describe later on. So these are the indication of that. And other than that, we have this area here. Upper area is called upper Mars, and below area is called lower Mars, and middle part is Mars area. So if upper area of Mars is well developed, so it's said to be a person will be having a good uh, aggression aggression qualities, and the person will be uh, good in controlling others. That is one of the thing and uh, 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 opposite to that if lower mars is good the person will not be a person who involves in the quarrels and uh, quarrel and fight so the person will be very much calm kind of in nature so that is opposite of that but if this is well developed you will get most of the quality from this part and this is the mars area if mars area is uh, you can say a lower uh, or you can say uh, look look uh, like a sink uh, uh, like if it is lower part little bit down area so person will get uh, suddenly get uh, emotional suddenly get uh, anger and uh, the reaction to that uh, uh, you can say uh, reaction to situation will be very quick sometimes it's is said to be uh, not a good sign because if something is happening to someone's life and someone is getting too much emotion in that case so that will affect the person but in your case also i see that there is some kind of higher in emotion part which is there so this might uh, make you a depressed or sad kind of person uh, as per the situation other than that let's go to the uh, heart line so this is the heart line uh, let me draw in the lighter line okay thin line so this is the heart line so what i see in ha heart line this heart line is very thick so thick heart line said to be a person will be very very emotional person and there is a possibility that uh, over emotions uh, of that person will make that person uh, depressed and some sometime a uh, person expect more from other but they won't though they won't get that part okay so that is this is one of the things so you might face something sadness or uh, we can say setback in related to emotion in your life so there is an indication of that part and there will be issue related issue in the eyesight or teeth okay and other than that this are the line which is going uh, from the heart line it's said to be a good sign because one heart line giving quality to other ma other mount is very, very good sign because if you're with the help of your emotion only you will get a uh, leadership quality in that one good execution and planning in that one because you are serious uh, with the help of emotions okay other than that i will be going forward with the headline so this said to be a headline and this headline what i see is that there is a lot of change structure so if this is there is some strange structure so this change structure give rise to a kind of trauma in your life so mental peace will affect you in that part so mentally you are a little bit depressed kind of and uh, you are a practical person but provided that your practicality will not affect with someone's imagination or the other way that will going to affect you but uh, what i see is that you have a moderate uh, uh, 
intellectual intellectual imagination or power so your uh, this kind of uh, per person will not be very good in or will not be at very high post but will be somewhere in a good position where they can able to make their career better because you have a good financial state okay other than that i will go with the uh, lifeline so this area of curve is said to be a lifeline so this lifeline what it does in your palm is that your life plan is good your health is good you are a person who are uh, cheerful in your life and that's why there is uh, you can say a good uh, uh, long life and healthy life will be there but related to emotion that is that i said uh, there will be a lot of expectation from your inner side but you if you don't get it you might get depressed other than that i i have one last line to say Uh, so there is one more line which said to be fate line or you can say career line so in, in your case the career line is good but there will be a some kind of change in that part so this said to be a, a age of uh, 22 to 26 so at this age you will try to change your career so you if you are thinking right now so this could be a uh, uh, right decision for you because this career another career will gonna uh, continue uh, till till 10 to 15 years then there will be a uh, area where you are not very much focused then again it will follow the career of uh, what you are following it might be a different one but at the age of 50 you will have a different career uh, option too okay so these are the reading or the insight from uh, my analysis and if you have any other query let me know and uh, yeah thank you for uh, making an interest and coming to for the reading yeah thank you so much